Right under the oh, cloud. Oh, 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 yeah, you'll put them on when we get in the air. Yeah, stick them on the glare shield under that. Right. Yeah. Is that all comfortable? Or relatively no, comfortable? Yeah. yeah. I'll try it uh, this time. Okay. Maybe next time I'll try hood, but okay. I already told yeah. this one. You've got both. So. Yeah. Because I'm not sure. to be I, I might have a bit of side uh, vision leak here. Okay, that's back. Again. You don't need to worry too much today because it's pretty cloudy. Uh -huh. So even if you look out, you ain't going to see much. <laughs> okay. So you will need to look at the instrumentation. On leaps and bounds now so we're going to do my next uh, trip is going to take you to Oxford uh -huh. and then to Wesco and then do a nav diversion uh -huh. and then hopefully when you've done the exams uh -huh. and uh, you can then go and do you'll do that okay then you can go and do the Brunton Thorpe Gaiden on your own uh -huh. and then you can do the, the uh, Silverstone at uh, the yeah. uh, gate at the um, Alconbury and Sywell if you're happy uh -huh. with the radio yeah and then we'll do the qualifier together and then uh -huh. you're going to do the qualifying cross country on your own uh -huh. and then we do some bit of revision uh -huh. And get you a tech, get you a license. Oh, it's all coming together for it, it, it only sounds very simple. But it, it is <laughs> because you've done most of the hard work now. Mm. You've done the precautionary circuits, mm. you've done those low level stuff, so you know how to do a short field landing if you need mm -hmm. to do it. Yeah. But this is good information and mm -hmm. it's, only a, it's only an idea of how to use it. You mm -hmm. need to practice it to get good mm -hmm. at it, but that's how it mm -hmm. works. All right. Okay, external check complete. Uh, cabin door you will hear. Yeah, uh, it's a lot of the Parking brake is on. Uh, sequence wheel belts on the right side. I think I've showed you this, but if that comes out a little bit, just vigorously pump it uh, like yeah. that. Yeah, because last it, time it started. Yeah, other, otherwise it will move forward. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It just needs to get the, the, yeah. the, the fluid around the system. Clear prop.
Pointy flying now, aren't you? Yeah. Yes, good. Really yeah. coming on well. Okay, it was yep. actually 
actually on the Yeah, we'll, we'll change it over. So just, let's just change it over so we can yeah. just check it works. Okay. Another tank. Total 2000. Good lookout. Yeah. 
south of Buckingham here and it's, uh, it's uh, nice and sunny. Roger, send it this way. Yeah, it should be happening before long, but so say it's the visibility is 10k, cloud base is estimated about 2,000 feet. It's a uh, broken cloud. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to maintain this length of radar scan, maintain the level. Yep. And I'd like you to turn onto a 308, 180 degree turn onto a heading of 300. Mm -hmm. So what you're going to do, you're going to maintain 15 degrees angle of back.
Get back into the middle. Wait yeah. until it gets nearly to the middle, then turn back off the back. Uh -huh. Ha 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 ha. 
Now this is working in exactly the same way as the Veerwaard mm -hmm. So it's telling you to see less than 319 Okay, so that's the direction that we are yeah. at the end on our side so Steer 30 degrees less than whatever is on there Push that course deviation index back into the middle uh -huh. And onto the same heading There's the slow school Yeah. 